Hey guys, go, go. Lord Naren White here, the Holy Ghost, the one true God. Back with you with the next video in my Witcher 3 playthrough. Without further ado, continuing Witcher 3. People repopulating the area, that's so nice. How nice is that? Hey, and we reached level six. That's huge. You know, Witcher, folk can say what they will. Me, I'll never forget what you did for us. Oh, that's so nice. I feel really really happy about that. Okay, well, with these two points, what do we want? Do I want fleet footed where damage received while dodging is reduced? Or do I want undying? Probably undying is safer. But frankly, if you are dying a lot, that's not very good. So. I really don't know. Is there something else I might want? Like. Ah, I know one that I really do want. This one here, cat school techniques. Each piece of light armor increases critical hit damage by 25% and fast attack damage by 5%. Cat school techniques is actually very important because we are going down the cat skill tree in terms of light attacks. So, yeah, I'm definitely gonna go with cat school techniques. For now, I think this is best. While we, you know, get some points for level 8, probably. I think that could be the safest option. Because we actually already have four pieces of light armor ready, so... That does mean... Double critical hit damage and... 20% more fast attack damage, so... Probably the single most useful skill at this point. Cool. Gwent cards? We're looking for Gwent cards specifically. No, but we actually should sell a bunch of this stuff I mean, as much as we can.
We definitely sell as much of this as we can. Uh, is there anything we want to buy? Doubtful. I doubt there is anything we want to buy. No, probably just have sold that stuff for now. <laughs> so long. That's it, Roach. <laughs> Pirate Leader's Notes Nothing quite like war. The Redanians and Nilfgaardians are at each other's throats, and no one pays a whit of attention to us. We can rob, raid, and kill till we get bored of it, which will never happen. Usually I never set ashore near populated places, but this time we had no choice. Our boat started taking on water after the last storm. We had to drag her onto dry land for some repairs. We were ready for a fight when we stepped onto the beach. But no one even tried to chase us off. Sometimes some of the Baron's blowhards come to us, but taking care of them's no trouble. Since we're not in any particular hurry, I've decided to build us a new vessel instead of patching up the old dingy. Why not? Best take advantage of the turmoil while it lasts. I hear there's a boatyard nearby that'll do just fine. And while we wait for a new ship, I'll send men out to look around for for Queen Zelikia's famous treasure. If it's worth a tenth of what I've heard, we'll all be rich. Well, I will at least. Not that.
It says there's some loot here, but I'm about to give up looking for it. I probably am not missing out on much anyways in terms of like this more like standard loot. Okay, that's fine. Let's see what else is here, I guess. Oh, wow, look at that. That's pretty cool right there. Griffin, uh... No. Uh, very nice. Okay. Let's go take a swim over here and see if we can actually get something. Hold on. Why does this bend camp not look cleared out? That's not good. Oh, here we go. Cavalry gauntlets, that's it. Alright. Cool, 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 cool. Just in the case that there are drowners down there, and sometimes there are. And drowners can get you pretty easily down here. You can use your crossbow, but you can't, um... You can't, uh, whatchamacallit, use your sword. You can only use your crossbow. Which is fine, it's not too much. Hey, nice. head over there. What's over there, do you think? Move it. So you see, there look to be drowners underneath the surface there. Not good. So here we go. So a lot of drowners here as you can see. Made it. Come on, Roach. Here we go. Guarded by what? Uh, yeah, alright, not bad. Going with Tawny Owl. Oh, 
for just this inevitability. Increase Quen production. Nice job. Very nice. Next, we'll probably... I said we'll just, you know, go in order here, clear everything out around here. And yeah, we'll do a lot of these, like, easier quests for now. Like, this one was here was a question, question mob, right? So, that's just, like, way too high level for us to bother spending time with that. And other than that, we can do all of these side quests, because, like, that's a lot of fun. So, let's do all of that, because we'll be doing that over the next few videos, probably. And that'll be a ton of fun. We'll see what all the stuff is there and everything like that, so yeah. Alright, let's keep going. Let's not get trapped in there for sure. Excellent job. I remember this quest had like two locations here. That's okay, we're a little far from it. We could probably get one, maybe even both, but let's hold off on this quest for now. Let's track a different quest. Let's track, um, this one here. I mean, there's actually other quests to track, too. I don't, I don't really know what to say in that respect. The fire cleanses. Join us at Devil's Leap. Sounds intense.
scum. You'll not stand for this, will ya? Reckon so, boy. What? Got anything interesting? I don't know if this stuff actually weighs anything. Like anything, right? Yeah. It doesn't weigh anything, so I don't really think there's a disadvantage just holding on to it. Like, why not just keep it, you know? Yeah. Uh, Farewell. Thank you. Wild hunts don't burn on them because they didn't respect the ladies. Actually, don't mind also if I meditate for an hour here and just regain our supplies a little bit at a safe spot. So, sounds nice for this hour. We got our thunderbolt back. Run, now we gotta sell everything because I am over encumbered. So what we'll do is we'll head over to this place here. burial ground in the caverns near about mid cops and a heap of monsters roaming about it uh, help me I assist when my
This is probably a little bit better. Oh no, I already sold it. It's too late, whatever. <laughs> it's not even worth it at this point. Okay, I know what we can do to, uh... She can repair everything. And, uh, before we sell more of these, let's sell the other stuff first. Oh, I can't seem to sell this here. Oh, that's sad. He'll accept. Which one is this? I don't know. But, um. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, we should sell these as well. This is becoming like unnecessary to carry these. Though it doesn't weigh that much, so that's the advantage there. Crafting, crafting, crafting. Um. Hmm. So eighteen armor, looking at our current armor, um, do you think our, it's worth crafting it? I mean, let's see. We have a current set here. It says 15 armor. Relic level 4. I mean, I honestly, let's just stick it out with what we have for now. And let's actually sell here with, um... Joanna as well. We can still sell all this stuff, so... What do you May as well sell it. No, she has a ton of uh, stuff, so... So that's really nice there. Ah, excellent. Well, that, that takes care of a lot of that stuff. And uh, will she buy the other stuff? No, she won't either. So, yeah. Oh, good. Take. Who will protect us four from the cutthroats? Who I ask? Fancy again. And that is where I'll go ahead and end the video there for this week. And so, with that I want to say, thank you for watching, and I uh, hope you enjoy it. Please like, comment, and subscribe, as it greatly helps the channel. I'd like to be with you all. Take care, and thanks again.